There are some creatures on earth who spend majority of their life in trees. They have evolved special adaptation to aid their arboreal lifestyle. Some of these animals jump from tree to tree and some animal produce special smell. Mass palm civet is an animal which produce special smell to scare off its predators. Its scientific name is Pacuma larvata. It belongs to the family Viviridae. They are named for their mask, which consists of a median white stripe from the top of the head to the nose, white marks above each eye extending to the base of each ear, and white marks directly below each eye. They are found throughout in Asia, Africa, especially in the Himalaya, ranging from Bhutan, Bangladesh, Myanmar, Thailand, Cambodia, Vietnam, Taiwan, and in Pakistan, this species is confirmed to be in Chitral, Sabad, Peer, Azad Kashmir, and Marihas. They have been considered as least concerned by IUCNs. They live in broadleaf forest, plantations, and gardens. They are found in temperate and tropical regions. They are native species of Africa and Asia, and they do not migrate. These species are heavily built. They have thick coat of fur that is usually grey or brown in color. They have black hair on their face. A white stripe begins at its nose and it goes all the way up to the forehead. Their dark eyes are highlighted by the white fur. This mammal's tail is long and it is covered with long fur. They have rounded ears which are inch long and it makes the civet look like a cross between a cat and a raccoon. But when it comes to their close relatives, they are more closely related to the mongoose than the cats. This species is omnivorous. It feeds on plants, roots, and also the arthropods and other animals. They can eat figs, bananas, mangoes and leaves and they can also eat mollusk, arthropod, bark and to lesser extent snakes and frogs. They have weaker and pointed teeth and the carnassial teeth are less developed. The premolars are small. The teeth of this Viveridae family have been evolved from the most primitive tree teeth of Pelusin propapus. These Pelusin mammals were small and they probably forage at night. They have been evolved from therapsids. Their skull is characterized by a single temporal opening on each side of cranium. The upper canines of these therapsid animals are enlarged. They sleep all day and they hunt at night. They are usually active between dawn. 4 a.m. in the morning, but they are less active during the nights when the moon is brightest. When alarmed, these animals spray a secretion from its glands against a predator. The spray is similar in function to that of a skunk, and its conspicuousness serves to deter other predators. These mammals are solitary, and they try to stay out of the sun. They spend most of their time in the trees. It is known that they spend 80% of their time in trees. They have developed long teeth to hang from the trees. Scientists believe that the white stripe on their face is the adaptation as their face serves as a signal to the predators that this animal can be dangerous. They are fast climbers. This is another way to get away from their predators. They have pads on their foot, which help them to climb fast. They are poly -estrous. They have two breeding years per year. The gestation period is 30 to 60 days long. The female bear up to four young ones. There seems to be a strong mother and young born during the lactation phase. The young ones open their eyes after about 9 days and they are of adult size within 3 months.